All right. Well, let's talk about um, a happier subject. Let's Yay. talk about uh, hard work. Your project. Because they're always just a, a happy-go-lucky topic. It's my favorite. People love talking about. Gangs. So let's just let's just transition away from politics, politics, and let's go into gangs and uh, just lighten the mood here. So tell me about uh, <laughs> tell me about hard work. So hard work, um, the idea came when I met my partner, Rod Weiler, uh, and we met through dating app, of course. Um, first, f- kind of like the first conversation that we were having, I was talking about the Pine Film Festival uh, because I curate for it, and I was talking about films that I had seen, and he was telling me that he uh, was shooting gang because he had shot a gang with his uh, previous partner. And the moment that he told me, I was like, oh my God, I, I need to be shooting why am I not shooting man once? And I think for me, it was kind of like, because I was telling you at the beginning, I come from this like old school feminist, um, you know, way of thought. And it took me a little, it was a long process for me to like deconstruct all of the, my own barriers that I had when starting to do uh, uh, and reclaiming like my own kinky, you know, sexuality and making, you know, understanding for myself that everything it's good and there, there's no sexual act that I should not be doing because it's not feminist or whatever. And suddenly, like, I hear, I'm hearing, like, and I think, like, gang, it's kind of, like, considered the ultimate, like, symbol of, like, a woman being exploited by all of these men, right? Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. I obviously love gang and I've been having gangbangs fantasies since as far as I can remember. <laughs> um, and of course, always feeling conflicted a little bit about those fantasies. Uh, and then suddenly I was like, no, this is this is the right time. I want to be doing, you know, the most like celebratory or jastic uh, fun gang uh, that I can imagine. And I want to make them like tailored to the fantasies of the person in the middle just to show like how much power and how much joy this person that is in the center of a gang uh, can have and enjoy, right? And I want to like, yeah, just celebrate that. <laughs> I love that. You know, I've shot three games in my life. And even though like logistically they can be kind of difficult because all those bodies moving together, like getting the penetration and stuff can be tough, but they have been some of the funnest shoots I've done. And I think it's because they were, uh, produced by the woman in the scene. So it was her idea. She hired the people in it. She dictated what happened, um, you know, and she hired me. So it was definitely uh, a scene that was curated and created by by the woman. And so it's very difficult to say, you know, oh, gangs, all gangs are exploitative if, you know, it's the woman putting it together, selecting the talent, like that kind of thing. Yeah, um, and I know that those definitely exist, and I know that there are, you know, some. There, look, the industry is not for everybody. I've said that it's a million times. It's a, it's a place where, you know, honestly, it's interesting. All the interviews that I've had, it's a place where I've spoken to women who've healed past like sexual trauma through the agency and the control that they felt that they had doing scenes, like they it was a way that they could kind of like work through their issues in a place that they felt was safe and they had control and that kind of thing. And then it's exacerbated traumas, sexual traumas of other people, you know? So it's just kind of one of those things that it's like, it can be great for some people and it can not work for other people. It's just, it's, it's, it's a thing and it's not like bad or good. It's just anyways. Um, so, so I definitely know that there is, I know that there are women who have done gang, who, who did it because they needed the money or they thought it was going to get them some award and they didn't really want to do it and they regretted it afterwards. And that's super, that's super regrettable. Um, but there's like a lot of women that who love it. They love the attention. They love being the center of attention. They love being like the celebrated person. And, um, you know, it's, uh, like I said, for me, the, the, I shot one for Lisa Ann, Riley Reed and Joanna Angel. And I had so much fun. <laughs> Nice. I mean, those sound like mm, really nice ones. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, I'm an only child, right? So I'm a princess also as a sap. And it's like, it is the ultimate scenario. Like you, like everyone is there for you and everyone is pleasing you and you're the, you know, you're the queen. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, so I, I, I love the idea that, that you're doing this. So like how, 
So, so you're, so how, tell me like how you go about like booking a scene. Like what is, where does it start? Do you start with the girl and then you, you talk to her about what she wants and then you let that guide, um, how you produce it? Exactly. That's how we do it. So, uh, I want to say we've been mostly shooting with women as the centers. We've also shot with a non-binary, uh, person and performer, and we will be hopefully shooting soon also with men as centers. So we want to like, um, yeah, we're gonna try every every possible constellation out. Mm-hmm. But we mostly have been working mm-hmm. with women as the center performers. Uh, and the way we go about it is, yeah, we let them first fill in a very long list. Um, it's kind of the list that you would uh, usually also fill in for like other BDSM parties or whatever. So basically, just goes mm-hmm. from kissing to, you know, whatever verbal humiliation, quadruple, you you tell you name it, uh, and you write down what's your experience with it. And how much would you like or not like to do it? So you can, you know, in, the, in this long list, you can already give like what's a, what's your limits, which a no no, uh, and what is something that you'd love to try out. And we also leave some space for them to write if there are any concrete either locations or folks or scenarios or ideas that they would like to to do. So with that, Rod and I sit down and look at it and and and, th- and start brainstorming and think we have different formats. So we feel like, okay, if it's someone, for example, that has not so much experience shooting, um, then we'd rather go for a smaller bang, right? So we have the, the smallest that we shot so far is just three bangers. So it's not so overwhelming um, in terms of how many mm-hmm. hands and are around you. <laughs> uh, yeah. And if it's someone that it's like, you know, I've already shot like whatever, a million guys but I want to do now this, I don't know, vampire dream. Then we're like, okay, let's, let's get them all, you know, let's mm-hmm. focus on that thing. Um, and then we have a conversation with, with them and propose like our ideas and just basically go back and forth until we found uh, the right concept, the right idea, the kind of location. Um, and, and then we propose also, I mean, we ask them if they have any cast wishes. So for their co-performers or otherwise we propose them a cast. And again, it's a bit of back and forth until we've, until we pin everything down, but they always have the last words. So we would never, mm-hmm. you know, push anything. We basically want to find something where the performer is like, fuck yes, I'm really looking forward to shooting this, you know? That's our aim. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered. And while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.